Francisco. Well, welcome to the blog, the video blog, and uh, we just finished the annual general meeting uh, five minutes ago, and we've gathered a group of delegates. My voice is almost gone, by the way, but we're gathered a few delegates to just let us know what they thought of the the event. So let me start with John Corlett from the Niagara Wine. John, what did you think? How did you find the meeting? Uh, tremendous, Scott. It's tremendous, everyone. I think it's really uh, easy for organizations to manage by objectives, but I think we do such a great job of managing by values as well. And we saw all the Y values come out of this really, really well this weekend. And I think Y Canada did a tremendous job. All the local associations sent tremendous people as they always do. Great level of dialogue, great level of result for everyone. Great. Fantastic. Just a, a hint for us all. Just focus on the camera because that's who's going to be watching us. Margaret, the, uh, the head of the MRC in Canada East and uh, our MRC coordinator, you've got a whole bunch of whys here. How was it? Oh, I thought the event was amazing. I especially enjoyed the, having the youth delegates with us. I think bringing 40 youth, outstanding youth at that, with all their energy, ideas, enthusiasm, really added a new component to the AGM. Wonderful. I'm going to skip over Marty and go to Lauren. Lauren, you're one of the youth delegates here. We had 40 youth delegates. It's fantastic. What was it like as a young person to be at this meeting? Uh, this AGM was a huge learning curve for me and it really cemented my spot or my role in the YMCA as an organization and it just, it, it was a great opportunity to network and to meet new people and just to really, again, get that impact that the youth are going to have in the next few years with the Y. Thank you. That's great. Thank you very much. Jim, how about, what's your sense of it? You were a pretty active participant. You had lots of questions, lots of things to share. A few questions, yeah. I guess that's how my mom brought me up. Ask questions <laughs> if you're not sure. So uh, I learned some interesting acronyms, the NRCCB, and, and certainly learned a lot about branding. Uh, which was an important thing that all of us need to come to grips with, to, uh, you know, make our why go uh, wisely into the future. Uh, it was great to hear about what we're going to do with the strategic plan for the Federation. If you don't have a plan, then how do you know where you're going? So I, I'm a firm believer in that. Uh, always happy to see that we're still going and focusing on delivery of service, and we're doing a, a look at that as we go through. And then finally, our fifth uh, initiative, talking about governance. Uh, you know, you need to look inwardly, inwardly once in a while to be able to look outwardly very efficiently and effectively. So all those things are great. I was energized by the presence of all the youth here, uh, even last night at the party. <laughs> very good. So thank you very much for inviting us. It was a pleasure uh, participating. Thanks, Jim. Yeah. Jennifer, I know you're, you're in the healthcare industry and there's lots of challenges in that industry. We're, we're an organization that also focuses on health. Any connections? Well, experience. actually, Scott, I'm a volunteer in the health care. I'm actually a farmer. Oh, so that's okay. my job. So, so, but I anyway, know we grow healthy food, so it's sort of related. Um, I want, do you want me to talk about my impressions? Of Absolutely. The, I, ha I have to argue, uh, uh, echo Margaret, in that having the youth here uh, gave us uh, enthusiasm and adrenaline and insight. And I liked one of the youth speakers actually started with a quote by Kofi Annan, is that a society that severs its youth, cuts its tie to its lifeline. And having them here sort of gave us a vision of, of who we are now and where we're going to, and I thought that was good. And also, Johan, I love, I was very proud of the fact that Canada is known for the joy of the ask, and how, and he asked us to bring that viral to the world, and I'm enthusiastic about, about that project as well. Johan, uh, I think to quote you, you actually said the happiness of the asking, which I think it sounds even better. Yes. <laughs> but, but, but Johan is the uh, incoming Secretary General of the World Alliance of YMCA's, currently the Secretary General of the European Alliance of YMCA's. You're kind of a stranger in a strange land, but, but, uh, but now an honorary member of, uh, of the Canadian YMCA National Council. I'm, I'm extremely proud of this and I feel really included. And again, as my previous visits to Canada, I go home with a lot of learning. This branding process and also the, the federation coming stronger together is so equal to the challenges of the, of the world movement. But first of all, I go home with my heart full of inspiration and I, I feel I need that. So thank you. It was great. Thank you, Johan. Thanks for being here with us. Susan Waterfield, the chair of the World Relationship Committee, did a great job of, of impersonating Oprah <laughs> <laughs> and, and helping us really, really get into the details of what Johan's vision is all about. Susan, what were your impressions? Well, I love the I love the whole weekend. I started on Friday with a meeting of the World Relationship Group going to Hong Kong. I really feel that we've never better been. We're, we're really well prepared to go to Hong Kong. All of the learnings of the weekend, I think, we'll take with us. 
I too um, was excited about having the youth here and certainly having the youth at our orientation on Friday was just exceptional. I would sum it up by really saying that I learned a lot. I learned a lot about branding. I learned a lot about what different people feel across the country. And frankly, I really believe in the future. Excellent. Thank you. And Marty, I'll leave the last words to you. Uh, the chair of the national board, Marty, you did a great job of leading this, this meeting. And uh, what do you, how do you feel about things? Well, I, I guess I feel really energized as well. Uh, and. Uh, and I feel really pleased that the movement has put so much confidence in us to allow us to go forward in this next year with these huge initiatives that uh, we have at our table. So, uh, and I too um, found that the youth here, it was awesome. And it was, uh, there's a real opportunity now to see this great talent we have. And I just hope once we see it, that we start to use it. So uh, I think that's what I would take away and uh, look forward to next year. Great. Thanks, Marty. And thanks, everyone, for watching the blog, and we'll, uh, we'll stay tuned. We'll keep these blogs coming. Thanks very much.